Okay, guys. Let's do a reading. Let's see what the hell comes out. Ooh, wealthy man. Okay, in the bag. Every time I'm in my bag and I put a wealthy man, I like it. So this is a good sign for somebody. Either you are a wealthy man, you're about to be one, you just became one, or there's a wealthy man that... I just heard a wealthy man protecting you. Fucking high. I don't know why I want to give somebody a high five. <laughs> Because when you got a regular person protecting you, it's all good. But when you got a wealthy person behind you, backing that up, I feel like whoever you are, you're going to be all right. Let's keep it this way, spirit. Nope. So, I thought wrong. Mm. Is this person very manipulative? <laughs> oh, because somebody said we all thought wrong. Somebody said we all thought wrong. Because somebody really selfish. So you could have had this. Can y'all see that? You could have had this wealthy man that was possibly posing and acting as if they was protecting you. They were going to share with you. They were going to give to you. They were going to do the right thing. I'm seeing like the Six of Pentacles, but they really the Six of Pentacles in reverse. Does this wealthy man just how they get over? Let's just see what this... Okay, before I go and talk, because I see we dealing with a tricky individual, so I can't say much. Let's observe. Seven of swords. God damn, this is a tricky motherfucker. Excuse me. But yeah, we dealing with a tricky motherfucker. Somebody is trying to figure out how they about to get away with something. That's money. This is how this person that acquired their wealth. And I thought they was protecting you. Damn, they said I thought they was protecting you too. God damn, so everybody thought this motherfucker was protecting you. We got the wealthy man that just played a group of motherfuckers, and this is how this person acquires their wealth. What exactly did they do? This is what I want to see now. Because I thought, I was like, whoo, this is good. This ain't good. Heart's desires. The angels are supporting and guiding you and protecting you as your dreams become a reality. Yeah, so it's not, it ain't this wealthy man. It's your angels. Wow, so some of you guys, we're dealing with a spiritual person. And you have this wealthy man. I need to put my readings out because I've been doing my readings. I know somebody's been doing spell work on me to shut me up because I've been feeling... Yeah, when I got back to my place, I don't even want to do shit no more. The vibe that I get now is not fucking good. I don't want to do shit. I don't get no motivation in this motherfucker no more. Because I feel it now. It's like, go, go, go. I'm getting pushed out. They pushing me out. And then my car just, my car is in fucking park. And that motherfucker just went for it. I, this shit happens all the time in this fucking car. Like, somebody's trying to force me out. I don't know if it's for my own growth or not. But the way that I've been feeling where I'm at, y'all, I've been feeling like it's a push out to get me out on my ass. Like, somebody's been manipulating my energy my relationships and not just intimate relationships because you never i was doing good being celibate but i fucked up um but just like relationships period right yo co partnerships collaboration somebody's been fucking all that shit up like they want me to be struggling with their i don't know who it is y'all i'm trying to pick i be trying to pick up on this shit and i can't put my finger on it at all because it can come from so many different ways. Like, people is... But for some of you guys, you're dealing with somebody like this. That's been trying to get you to put out of something. They want to see you fall flat on your ass. Some This wealthy man has something against you for whatever reason. I, for some of you guys, I feel like you don't even know who this wealthy person is. Let me tell you something. Because I did a reading, and I said somebody's been manipulating what's been coming into you and your, for when it comes to your business. Because they feel like you don't know shit. You don't know who's been giving to you. You don't know who's been sponsoring you. I don't know what the fuck it is that you do. For some of you guys, for example, I'm going to use Tarot as an example. You may be a Tarot speaker. So a lot of times when we're doing Tarot, a lot of the energy that we pick up is another Tarot reader. Most of the time we get on here because we've been going through something. We need some type of guidance as well, too. We may not say it, but it's like the real readers is going to know because you're going to start hearing people without hearing, without seeing them. You're going to hear the bad and you're going to hear the good. You're going to know who's crying out for you as far as I need your help. And you're going to know who's been manipulating your energy. 
okay? Cause like I, I, it's been a couple of times I didn't hear people, I didn't felt people, and I'm like, damn, hold on, let me get doing reading. And I didn't did readings, and these readers don't even know I watched them. And it's been a couple of times where I've been like, damn, I think this is going towards this fucking reader because this reader also just spoke about something of that nature. You get what I'm saying? But anyway, and I'm talking about for the real ones, not the ones that be in people's business. It's crazy when you got like a real. It's kind of like when you have a child and you can feel like your child is something is going on. Like that motherly energy. But anyway, somebody's been feeling like somebody has been in help and in need, but this person has been manipulating that shit. Somebody has been getting a lot of resources and funds on your behalf, and they trying to figure out how they about to get away with this shit, this wealthy fucking man. They being real sneaky and deceptive. But whoever you are, you have a real connection when it comes to, like, the spiritual world. Okay, you got some type of ancestors that are really guiding you, protecting you, and you got other people that's about to... I said about to. That's about to step in and protect you because this wealthy man has been doing a real fucking good job. I don't know what they've been doing, how they've been manipulating people, but they've been manipulating people acting as if y'all been working together. But y'all have not. This motherfucker is sneaky than a motherfucker. I don't know how they do what they do, but they do that shit well. They do it real well. October. You cannot make this shit up. So what's what happened? So either something happened into October. This person may be born in October. Or something is coming to you in October. Either something came to you in October and this person ran off with it. Or something is coming to you in October and they know it. And they trying to figure out how they about to be sneaky and deceptive and get away with it. So I'm talking to somebody. I don't know if you're aware. Somebody, look, they being an instigator. They being an instigator. Now, for some of you guys, they could say that they ran off on this or they took whatever they took because of an instigator. But I think this is this wealthy man. I think it's just this wealthy man, y'all. And they fought the fuck out of me. It's safe for you to receive. Hmm. Let's keep going before I, I'm gonna I'm, just hold that before I get to talk. Anyway, Queen of Pentacles in reverse, though. So now, for some of you guys, this wealthy man is gonna come back around to you and give you something because they see you deserve. Y'all hear my fucking car? They 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 feel like you deserve it. They feel like okay, it was an instigator that got in this mix. Whoever this queen of pentacles that's in reverse, it could be an air sign. It don't have to be, but it's somebody that's very smothering, controlling, somebody that also does bad business. They manipulate people when it comes to the finances. They're the queen of pentacles in reverse, and they could have said that you with the queen of pentacles in reverse. Don't invest in this person. Don't share with this person. Don't collaborate with this person. They're selfish. They're greedy. They're going to take from you. Blase, blase. So this person held back from you, but now they're seeing... It's something with your heart space. I've been talking about somebody realizing somebody's been a love and life. Somebody realizes now, like, you, you have, like, a very big heart. You have a good heart. You wouldn't do them like that. You wouldn't do nobody like that. I don't know what this is. Now, for some of you guys, you had a sponsor watching you, an investor watching you. You had somebody watching you for a while that's been wanting to invest in you. And somebody has been manipulating that energy manipulating you and your energy is trying to stop this person from reaching out to you or investing in you something of that nature we got page of cups in reverse so somebody was being very very childish immature they wasn't using their intuition or this caused this person to hold back this offer For some of you guys, there was a lot of rumors going around this person and around you. And about somebody, some people that, like, were minors. Abuse. You see, there's something going around talking about some type of abuse. Or somebody is not, it could even be dealing with how somebody handled kids or something of that nature. Somebody could have, this could even be like a job offer that somebody was trying to give to you to pro collaborate with you. I've been, I talked about this too in another reading. I gotta find these readers and put them together. The lovers, but this person love you. 
damn, I feel like this person wanted to work with you, and somebody held this person back from working with you, and this person could have like got intrigued and possibly was watching you for a minute, and they end up falling in love with you. Somebody fell in love with you. Like, not only do they want to invest with you now, they also want to, like, they want to marry you. This is could be what they thinking. Like, they might not come to you flat out. They want to date you and court you, but they looking at you now like, damn, no, you can have my kids. You can take care of my kids. Male or female. Because, although I'm saying wealthy man, it could be a woman, you know? <clears throat> but somebody don't see what whatever somebody else was saying. They don't see that in you no more. Now, for some of you guys, this could even be saying... Somebody been fucking a oh excuse me. Somebody's been sleeping with a wealthy man though, and this wealthy man is very selfish, and they're being very childish. They do not like you. The lover, the page of cups in reverse. They have no feelings for you at all. None, none. Because page of cups is a small offer, but with it being reverse, they don't fuck with you at all. They figuring out how they're gonna take from you. You should feel that somebody's not using their intuition. You feel that this connection is janky as fuck. You know that. They have somebody that they're with. They have a lover. They got a lover. And this person is fucking abusive. They plan on coming to you, manipulating your energy, taking from some of you guys. This person could be like a talent. A talent. Woo, they don't want me talking about this. They said, bitch, you going too far. Because somebody work in some type of industry where they, like, have clientele or they may have say they have clientele. You are their clientele, but you may not even know you are their clientele. You are sleeping with this person, but they are telling people you are their fucking clientele, y'all. Like, somebody could be, like, a talent, um, a talent scout, like a talent. Somebody runs a fucking talent agency, a secret talent agent because agent. It, it, so words just got to spit the fuck out. I'm so sorry, yeah. Somebody, like, runs a secret talent agency, scouting agency. I don't know what the fuck. Something of that nature. Somebody is, like, a promoter, a business, uh, the pro marketing manager. Something of that fucking nature. You are somebody's client and don't even fucking know it. You're, like, somebody's, somebody is somebody's top paid hidden fucking client. Okay, I did this other reading where I said somebody is a um, a hidden expert consumer, but they hide you, but they watch everything it is that you consume and shit, and they they would however the thing that you buy somebody. Okay, I think I might be going too far. Anyway, um, we got successful funding. Now this going back to this person that may have been wanted. You guys can't see that, but it's there. This person that wanted to fucking um, invest in you. Or this person began a lot of funding from you for you that they ain't been. Child, y'all get what I'm trying to say. What the fuck is this? We will be together again. So this person is animate on having you back. I knew you was fucking them. Excuse my language. You was sleeping with this person. And this person got shy to you, jealous of you. They made money off of you. And they tried to figure out how they was going to run off on it, take it, all type of shit. And now they trying to figure out how they about to get back to you. I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm going to be real with y'all. This ain't for me to like, though, y'all. That was me moving in my seat. If y'all heard anything, I swear if I was proud, I would have been like, excuse me. <laughs> but anyway, um, I don't like this person. I don't like this person at all. Not one bit. Hell no, I don't. Because this person then fucking came in your life. They fucking on you. They made a lot of money off of you. <laughs> Left on you. And now they trying to come back to you, figure out how they about to... Because they, I feel like they going broke. The last reading I did, I said they coming back because they come... They, I hope I still got that reading. Man, it didn't sleep. Because this person is hoping that you can forgive them one day for the blackmail that they did on you. By doppelganging you. If this is that same reading. Mm-mm-mm. That ain't nothing. That's a receipt. Now let me look at this. How the fuck is this thing in here? Maybe it's got something to do with something. This is dealing with herbs, rosemary, a wellness spa. 
Empress some okay, hold the fuck up. For some of you guys, this motherfucker got funding for businesses and shit. Somebody got like businesses and shit under your name as you. I mean, somebody was getting like big funding. Who the fuck am I talking to? Like, it may not be exactly like your name or something of that nature, but it was the purpose for for like for you. This person could even be trying to fix, find, replace. Oh my goodness, replacements and people to fill in. What's going on, spirit? What the fuck is this shit? Six of Pentacles. Didn't I say that the six of Pentacles? Can't make this shit up. I know who I am. Somebody is with the giving and receiving. Your clientele. Somebody be getting funding for you. And or somebody is ready now to... Y'all take it however it resonates. Somebody is now ready to give to you after not giving to you and after taking from you. account so somebody had a fake account as you and made money had big funding all type of shit big funding yeah you may be over love from this whole situation just over it done because you may realize okay now for some of you guys it ain't even nobody y'all big and shit. Because y'all know we got wealthy people in the hood. They hit for, they be up 20 racks, 10 racks. That's being rich in the hood. Y'all know what I'm talking about? 30 racks. Some of you guys, this was a lover of you guys. This doubt y'all was dealing with. And they they was hitting, I'm going to say hitting big. And that's going to resonate with anybody however way. They was just, they was getting dope. They was getting funding, passing, and just however it resonates with whatever. Okay, but it was in a fucked up way, and it could have been off of you. They could have been doing this to a lot of other people, too. All right, but they kind of feel like they fucked up when it happened, how they did you, and now they want to come back to you. They trying to figure out how they about to come back and be in your fucking good graces. I heard, too, right now, somebody said, you the only one that held it down. Child, look, Jesus, I don't know. I don't know what happened. Hey, the story. See, but this person is in a mental entrapment now. Because they also know you over love. You may not even trust them. You may not even trust nobody. If it ain't came out what happened, something gonna come out about what happened. And I feel like it's very October is very fucking significant. And I can go so many different fucking ways. And we got new love. So this person wants to come in and be a new love to you, but I kind of feel like it's too it's too too late. You may be over love with them, and you may be wanting a new love somewhere else. Keep going. What else is going on? This ain't. The world. Yeah, you wrapping this shit up. Because I feel like whoever you are, even if you don't know exactly what's going on, you have a feeling. You have some type of intuition. You knew that this person was not fucking with you how they said they was fucking with you in the beginning. So you like this shit done. Spirit said it's done. The real. We're trying to wrap this shit up. I feel like this person all in their head though. Worrying about karma. For how they treated you. Page your wands in reverse. Yeah, this bad news. This is bad news. I've been thinking of the future. But you like, hell no. Nah, I'm going to get excited no more about this. You've been thinking about the future. You've been thinking long term. For some of you guys, too, because I, I said some, you don't want to hold it down. Some of you guys are thinking about, I'm not about to get wrapped up in your bullshit, right? Especially if you didn't hold it down for me. You read off for me. You didn't share shit with me. For some of you guys, that's why this person is about to give to you because they felt like they know you deserve it because of whatever. You guys, you know, just they feel like you deserve it, man. I feel like it's gonna be a, a, a situation because you may, look an offer. They want to give you this offer, but I feel like you not fucking feeling it. Page of Wands in reverse, and that's what's gonna start an issue. They're gonna get big headed. They're gonna think they money can fucking solve anything. Yeah, use your intuition. Use your intuition.
family room in reverse because some secrets about this family dynamic or what's going on is really going to come out. For some of you guys, this could even be somebody in your family that did this to you. Some of you guys, the secrets about <laughs> them having the family is that. Be mindful because this person may be trying to have you as a side person because I feel like for some of you guys, this person got a wife. Attraction, yeah. There's a lot of attraction here, but uh, it's... it's I feel like somebody already know that maybe that's why I'm doing this reading. Because you yourself have a lot of attraction for this person. Y'all, everybody might really been walking out. It's how I know. Like, what y'all doing? Y'all trying to team up to see something, to know something? What the fuck is going on? When I walked out, everybody walked out. About motherfucking. I'm just trying to count. Let me just hold up a count. One, two, three, four, five six seven people have just have walked out it's me right after i walked out shit is insane but um what does it say oh authorities child i didn't even realize that was oh okay but authorities is in this mix like i said somebody else pulling up like i said for some of you guys you may be like um how can i say it you just be mindful because it's a lot that come to this mix. It's a lot that come with this shit. You may have a lot of attraction for this person. A whole lot. But just pay attention to how they want. They gonna be trying to have you perceived and shown to everybody else. Because you may be seen as a house wrecker. Ain't no telling how they was using you as clientele. Apology, I'm sorry. So, somebody wants to apologize. And it may only be because the authorities may have got involved. This may even be your family, y'all. Your parents. Seven of swords in reverse. Because somebody ain't got caught being sneaky and deceptive. Yeah, they getting exposed. So, something is getting exposed. Do a lot. The authorities may even be involved. So somebody may have no choice but to come clean, but to apologize, but to give something up. King of Cups. And this may be a father figure. Child. I feel somebody feel like they don't they they are caught. Damn. Healer. If somebody know you are a healer. Child, I'm about to get three more. Wrap this up. Try yoga or exercise. So whoever this is, somebody may need to exercise or try try yoga if you ain't been in yoga, just to release some stress and some anger. Cause I feel like you're gonna be real pissed off. Yeah, but cover up is about to be money showers. Cause something about to come to you. Whatever they took from you, whoever did whatever they did. This third party, whoever this is, they didn't try to put you in this third party or keep you as a third party in the middle of some bullshit. That's what that is. All right, so, but I love you guys so much. Take care. I feel like God about to bless you for all the seven of swords, deception, energy, and all that bullshit. But again, I love you guys. Take care. Try some yoga and mama stay.